YouTube and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to howl and like I don't have any requests but whenever I type it in because I'm, I'm a very wolf type person I love wolves and I want to be very close to them and I want to like practically be like one of them but um like how to growl and stuff. There aren't many growlers and howlers. Hey, that rhymed. There aren't many growlers and howlers on YouTube. And I made one video of me growling, but YouTube, stupid YouTube deleted the quality. Could have been a better video if it had quality. Anyway, I'm going to teach you guys how to howl so I can, like, bring up the videos of howling. I don't know. Okay, but... The first thing you do when you howl, it's like everybody has their own unique way of howling. And um, what I use, most people have obviously used their throat because that's where their vocal cords are. But some people, they might even like use their stomach to howl. Everybody you, like growls and howls with their stomach. But it's also my way of doing it is like in the back of your throat sort of. And this is how you're going to do it. You're going to take three deep breaths. I mean, you don't have to. Sometimes I just go, <gasps> and then howl, but it doesn't really matter. And, okay, I know this might sound gross, but my way of doing it, think of it as, like, um, forcing a burp. Forcing a belch or something out of you. And, you know, when you do that, you're like, and you're, like, you're trying to push something out of your throat, like, until something comes out, not throw up, just like that. And you can sort of feel or, yeah, feel or even hear something from your throat go up and down. I don't know what it's called. I don't even know what is going up and down, but um, you'll do that and you'll hold that position. And when you're holding that position, you're just going to let out a howl. And I would recommend cupping your hands like this. So it's sort of like a, a wolf muzzle. And make sure you look passionate about it, too. So, like, like you can start off with a high pitch one, like, or you can even start out, like, and, like, work your way up. I've heard those before, but I prefer to do it my way. Here is how I howl. Like, I have many ways of howling, but I'm just going to pick out one of them. <clears throat> make sure you clear your throat before you do it, too. That'll mess up your howl and, like, make cracks in your voice. <clears throat> for me it's it's and i bet youtube's gonna delete, delete the quality again in my house so it's not gonna sound as good as it would if you were here in my room or in person with me right now but um the thing is for me it just comes, I guess it just comes naturally, lol, I don't know. It just comes naturally for me. I mean, I'm a born howler. I don't know what to say about that. But you, it's mostly in the throat area. Yeah, obviously it's in the throat area. And again, you hold that position like you're trying to belch or burp or whatever. Yeah, burp sounds like a kid word. I'm going to use the word belch. So, um, like when you're trying to belch, you go, again, okay, let me re just review the whole thing. Again, when you're trying to do a howl, it's almost like you're trying to belch or burp or whatever, you know, when you go and you like feel something in your throat go back and forth. You'll hold that position. Then you'll do your howl. And yeah, that's about it. But, um... When you cup your hands, like, I won't do it without my hands. Ready? Go. Okay. Actually, that was a pretty bad example because they both sounded the same. But usually, like, I was in gym today, and I was doing some howls silently to myself, and I noticed that if you cup your hands, if you cup your hands like that, you'll get sort of like a deeper howl. Like... Yeah, deeper, because wolves have pretty deep howls. Sometimes they're like a chihuahua, and they're like... <coughs> like, sort of females, even uh, uh, wolf cubs, they'll howl like a very, very high pitch one, because they're young. 
well, mostly the wolf cubs. The females are sort of like, and males are like, but way deeper, because I'm a girl, and I can't really do a deep voice. But, and also, um, I know I'm not doing a growling video, but if you want to learn how to growl, you can also look at videos like, uh, Death Metal. You've heard of, obviously, Death Metal. You can look online, or even Google if you want, Yahoo, I don't care, really, and, um, look up, like, how to scream, well, not scream, but growl in, like, Death Metal music, because that would really help, too. Actually, after this video, after I upload this, um, I'm going to, like, edit it and stuff. I think I'm actually going to look at some videos on death metal growling because um, it'll help with your your growling also. But I don't know why I'm bringing up growling. This is a howling video, but it can still help you with growling. I might make a growling video sometime. And if you do, that answer is I did make one, so that's awesome. And just one more review. You do the belch thing. You hold that position. Then you do your howl, and then that's it. But you can also do a growl. Oh, yeah, like a little growl. I thought I said howl for a minute. Um, you can also do like a little growl before you start your howl like this. I'll do that a little louder so you can hear. Like that. It's uh, pretty easy. And it, it just comes naturally for me. Everybody has their own unique way of howling. And that's my unique way. I'm pretty happy of how my howling turned out. Because every day I would howl and practice. Well, not practice. Because I'm already, like, at my full limit. of. I don't really need to practice anymore. I just howl. But if I mess up, I just do it again. And don't give up on howling if you're frustrated. I'm getting a little frustrated on growling. Because... You, if you haven't seen my growling video, look at it, because YouTube again deleted the quality, and I think I'll make a growling video sometime. But this is howling, a howling video, a different story. So yeah, you just do the belch position, and then howl, and you can add a, a growl or even before you do it, or even work up to it, like, like work up like that. So yeah, I hope this helps. Um, subscribe, rate, comment. I know a lot of people say that. I've noticed a lot of people say that on YouTube. Subscribe, rate, comment, gigantic buttons, like gigantic art after the video. Subscribe. I mean, guys, you don't have to subscribe to me or if you don't want to. It's just a suggestion. It's, su it's just a suggestion. But, I mean, if you want to, you could. And, yeah, if you want to. I'm kidding. Um, I'll see you in my next video, which is probably going to be how to growl video, um, maybe even a bark video, a whimper video. I don't know. I will see you guys later. Peace.